radiation film like this has never been done, and Chechnya will never be done again. It's very important to me that it be practical, that we actually put the camera right in there and shoot the sequences for real. That was the aim, that was always the goal. And I said, I'm not gonna make this film unless we can accomplish that. Tom told me from the very start, this is gonna be harder than you would think. And he was right. Getting a camera into a Navy F-18 is a lot harder than it sounds. Getting six cameras in there is almost impossible. We worked with the Navy for over a year to design a system that would get the angles we wanted to get, but also did it in a way that didn't interfere with any of the functions of the airplane. We had to go through all kinds of engineering, and it had to be built to specifications. Anytime we put anything in the cockpit of an F-18, we have to be very clear what impact that's gonna have. If those cameras come off under G, now you have something coming back and hitting an actor or going forward and hitting the pilot, and that could be bad. So we had to make sure everything was gonna stay on the airplane throughout the entire flight. The Navy basically told us what we had to do in order for it to stand up to seven and a half Gs and 550 knots. These cameras are unbelievable, groundbreaking. They are specifically built for Top Gun. The camera actually splits into two pieces. You can put your lens anywhere you want and have the recording far away. That allows us to put them in places that normally would never be able to fit a motion picture camera. These aren't GoPros, you know. These are 6K IMAX quality cameras. Check this out. So the image we're getting is something that's just never been captured before. <laughs> What do we have here? Yeah, here I thought we were special. Fellas, this here's Bagman. Hangman. Oh, whatever. What the hell kind of mission is this? Everyone here is the best there is. Who the hell are they gonna get to teach us? Captain Pete Maverick Mitchell. Let me be perfectly blunt. You are not my first choice. You are here at the request of Admiral Kazansky, AKA Iceman. He seems to think that you have something left to offer the Navy. What that is, I can't imagine. With all due respect, sir, I'm not a teacher. Just want to manage expectations. Captain speaking. And we're off. Here we go. In three, two, one. We're going into combat on a level no living pilot's ever seen. Not even him. You think up there you're dead. Believe me. My dad believed in you. I'm not gonna make the same mistake. Someone's not coming back from this. Those are your pilots. Anything happens to them. You will never forgive yourself. No turning back now. Fun yet?